can be the six million. What's up, y'all? Anwar and our show here. Ready to talk about uh, some other stuff that I've seen. I, I, I'm sorry, y'all. I, I be trying to just mind my business and do my own thing, but today's the right day, so fuck it. Like, I've been seeing a lot of stuff about the whole caffeine situation and, um, you know, whether or not you own your content once you do something on caffeine. So, as somebody with a caffeine partnership, I figured, fuck it, why... Why not actually explain it as opposed to letting people just run wild with their narratives? And again, whether you choose to believe it or not, that's your business. But I'm going to go ahead and break it down for you. Make it pretty simple. I hope that it's easy to follow along. Um, yeah, that's that. So first things first. Caffeine partnership. What does that mean? That means that caffeine has come to you and said, hey, we would like for you to provide, you know, your content on our platform. Caffeine is a live experience platform. That's what they care about. They care about the live experience, the interactiveness of the comments, the chats, the props, things like that. That's all they care about. Once your content, once your live stream is over, in the software that you use to stream on Caffeine, well, unless you're streaming through the browser. But they have a software. It's called OBS. It's free. Like, you could, it's out there. Everybody knows what OBS is. But in OBS, there's a setting that says record, you know what I mean, your broadcast. Caffeine has OBS built in when you download, you know what I mean, uh, uh, the, the broadcasting tools. It's literally OBS with a caffeine client. In it. So in there. You are allowed to record your content. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah. Say it again? Yeah, you're allowed to record your content. Wait, what? And then, what you can do with that recorded content is this. Y'all ready? Put it on YouTube. Whatever you want. Yeah, whatever, whatever you have on your caffeine stream, once the stream is over, put it on YouTube. That's what I do. Who it belongs to? It's my content. It's whose? Mine. Like, it don't belong to caffeine. You you own your content. Like, I don't understand where this, this mantra of caffeine owns your content came from. Like, I really don't know where that started, but I'm here to tell y'all it's not true. Like, it's literally not true. Your content is your content. So, if you do a caffeine live stream doing battle rap predictions, you record it, upload it to YouTube channel. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Whether you want to check it out on our channel or head on over to Champion. There are Champion episodes where you hear us talking to the chat. It was broadcast live on Cafe, then edited and put onto YouTube. It happens. I don't know why that is like such a thing. I, I guess... People want to not rock with caffeine, I guess. I guess that's what it is. Like, I get it. Genesis happened. It was a shit show. The stream was all jacked up. Everybody had something to say, myself included. I get it. Then Gnome happened, and it was, oh, my God, they're not using Avo. And as far as the quality of the stream... I'd give it like a 7 out of 10, 6 and a half maybe. Like I said, I'm on record. I've said many times on Caffeine, which after I did it live on Caffeine, we saved it and then loaded it to our YouTube channel. But I've said before that I didn't want to see, you know, the, the, the some of the camera angles. They, there's one particular camera angle. Geechee was going crazy in his round with Verb, and they switch camera angles, and it's like a down below shot. You see the little... I don't know what it's called, the little box thingy that they have for their microphones clipped to his back pocket. Like, I don't want to see Ichi's ass in a video. I just don't. I, that's not what I, I tuned in the gnome for. But all in all, like, it wasn't a bad experience. So I, I, I didn't get that. But it's like the cool thing to do is to, what, just try to find ways, make shit up, to talk shit about caffeine. Like, personally, I don't get it. I don't get it. But I just wanted to chop that fable, man. Like, if you 
as a YouTube supporter, as a battle rap supporter, whether you like or dislike URL, King of the Dot, RBE, whoever, whatever you want to do, if you decide to go live on Caffeine, you are allowed to record your live. The so Again, it's built into the software. Feel free to hit me up. I've talked to some battle rappers. I've helped them as far as just saying, yo, make sure you, re I, like I tell you, make sure you record your shit. Put it on your YouTube channel. Like, so if you have any questions, feel free to add me on Twitter, man, at Jesse Hamilton. Anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video to chop that fable, man. I've been seeing it around, seeing it around, and now I'm seeing it a little bit more. And from people with, uh, I guess the best way to put it is bigger voices in the culture. So before that, you know, grows legs, and then there's a whole big thing. Figured I might as well go ahead and do this video. So anyway, I'm Jesse Anwar. It's the Anwar Show. Peace out.